when the candy canes are all gone and it's Christmas Eve, we get the cup. And if you're awake, you don't get any presents. Wait. You want to show them that cup? This is our Santa cup. We're going to put our milk and cookies. Well, not the cookies. But we're going to put our milk in there, right? Right. Because if he... he we have this um, so he could drink for it. Or maybe we can give him a candy cane instead of a cookie. Oh. We'll have to decide, huh? Yeah. It's a pretty big decision. Well, hey guys, it is mid-afternoon and we are just getting Gene ready to go on his trip. It snowed quite a lot last night, so he went and he shoveled the driveway for us and hoping that the highway is going to be okay. So I'm putting together his bag of snacks so when we do road trips, or he does, I guess, really mostly, um, he likes to grab some snacks from Costco. So I am just putting them all together in a bag for him. Um, and he's going to be leaving soon. So I am just cleaning my drip pans. Um, we had a little accident last night with some milk that spilled over. So here are the snacks that um, she is taking. So this is trail mix from Costco. Big bag of jujubes and steak strips. So this is like jerky. It is so, so good. Um, this would make a really great gift with maybe like a $10, $20 gift card. Um, for a man in your life, or I guess even a woman if she loves that kind of thing. Um, I love it. It's really good. I don't know if I'd want it as a gift, but um, for those hard-to-buy-for guys, this is awesome. And then I'm going to get... Uh, I had an apple out. I don't know what I did with it. So, I'm going to get an apple. And get him ready to go. You forgot your clothes. Well, you pulled some clothes out of that clothes basket. Okay. Maya! Colty, who are you pretending to be? Maya, Mommy! I'm smiling, but who are you? Me, Papa. You're Papa? Yeah! <laughs> when you put on your robe, you pretend you're Papa? I need your boots. Yeah, you need some boots? Okay. <laughs> Y'all, we need our board and bat and done. We are overrun with coats. Shane is going to get that done um, during his Christmas vacation, which I'm so excited for. Papa, I wear your boots. You're going to wear your boots. Just like Papa? Yeah. Oh, no. I'm your... Uh-oh. Take her off. He wants you to go lay in bed with him, Grandma. Oh, I think I'm too weak to walk. Oh, gee, your grandma's not ever too weak to walk. Look, he's waiting for you. I help. Oh, Grandma, sorry, I hurt. watching. The Grinch. 
Colty, what are you watching? Um, watch a bridge. Watch a bridge? Yeah. Yeah. He's a mean one, Mr. Grinch. <laughs> He's a mean one, Mr. Grinch. He's a mean one, Mr. Grinch. Okay, so there was this recipe that someone shared on Facebook, and it was from Hershey's. Um, I don't know if it's Hershey Kisses or if it's just the Hershey's Facebook page, but it was about um, kind of like an Oreo ball type recipe with um, candy cane Hershey Kisses in the center, and then they're rolled in like white chocolate with some candy cane sprinkled on top. And I had all of the ingredients except the... Um, candy cane Hershey Kisses. I have regular Hershey Kisses, but I didn't have the candy cane ones. So I was kind of thinking in my mind about what I could use, because I can't get to the store. And I thought about, since I used to have a brand called Velada. Now in August, I think it was of this year, um, Velada is no longer available. However, I was a huge fan of Velada, even though I didn't sell it. And I have a lot of Velada still on hand. And Velada is um, it was um, chocolate fondue pots, and it, um, it was basically like Sensi technology melted with the heat of a light bulb, and it was like extremely good chocolate um, that they had, and they had a bunch of other stuff. Um, anyways, and the chocolate would never burn. It was just incredible. Anyways, I have one of their candies here, and it's peppermint bark flavor. So I am going to chop these in half because they are like discs and we're gonna um, make our little chocolate covered Oreo balls around that. So this will, will be our first time making these. We're pretty excited and the kids are gonna help. They just got their hands washed and we're gonna go to town. Okay, so this is the Velada warmer, one of them that we have and inside is the um, meltable. So it's just like a candy coating. Um, this is Velada brand. However, on the video, I'll see if I can find it and link it down below. They use um, just white, I don't know, they don't even show it, but it's probably just like white chocolate chips or white candy coating. So this is what we have on hand, so this is what we're going to use. And then the kids are going to go ahead and chop up some candy cans. I'm going to put them in these sandwich bags, so they'll each get one. And then they'll have a couple candy canes in. And we've got a couple mashing tools here for them to use to smash them up. And we are going to get on that project. And then I'm going to go ahead and cut the um, meltables in half. Colt looks so thrilled. Well, my candy cats. Yes, you want me to open the I want this one. Okay. Smash! Smash! <laughs> I'm Careful, smash don't hit the camera. Don't smash. hit your brother. I don't think so, Lady Lou. <laughs>
so this is how they turned out. <laughs> they're kind of ugly little things, but I think they're going to be delicious. We're going to have one after we have our supper. And they'll probably look a little bit prettier once they're all set and ready to go. They should be good. Yeah. So Aubrey wants to tell you. Go ahead. Um, I um got all of the. Wait. I got all of the sprinkle um candy cane that we mashed up, mm -hmm. and I poured it, and it was a lot. Oh, ow. It was a lot. I went like this. I'm going go yep. We are excited about I'm that. One. I might eat it. No one else is going to eat it. I am. <laughs> So, cooking with kids is fun. Um, I think we washed our hands about a hundred times. And no, five times. Oh, five times. Excuse me. It just felt like a hundred. So, I'm going to go ahead and get uh, dinner started. We're probably just going to have some leftovers. I made um, a recipe my mom always made when we were growing up called uh, chicken and biscuits. And it's... Um, chicken in like a, a yummy delicious kind of gravy um, although I use turkey and because you could use turkey in it and I'd made a turkey the night before so I think I'm gonna have the leftovers of that and the kids will probably just have whatever they they're so very picky so um, we'll have some fruit and veggies and probably bread <laughs> we'll see some turkey maybe leftovers so that's kind of where we're at now. Um, I plan to make a lot of cookies and stuff today. We just never really got around to it. It's snowing quite a bit now. Shane's out on the highway, so we're just kind of hoping that he's okay. We're praying for him and uh, hoping that's all good. So I'm going to go ahead and get dinner started. Um, I'm listening to Spotify, like a Christmas playlist, and I don't know. It's not all that great. So. so quick little grocery haul. I had Shane pick me up some carrots and celery. I'm going to um, take my turkey carcass from the other day and uh, make some turkey soup. And we needed some unsweetened um, coconut for some jam thumbprints that I'm going to do. I have Ina Garten's recipe for those and they are so delish. Um, and so speaking of those... I have some apricot jam and then some strawberry jam to go in the thumbprints. And then we're also going to do peanut butter blossoms. So I had Shane get me some Hershey Kisses. So that's our quick little grocery haul. And then here are all of our little truffles. There's two layers in this little tin. And then these were the ones that were left over. So we're going to have, um, the kids will have one for their dessert. I'll probably have the rest <laughs> maybe we'll see <laughs> so dinner tonight is just a hodgepodge of stuff I'm trying to clean out the fridge a bit so this is two biscuits with the um, turkey gravy over top that's for me um, the kids are having some sweet potatoes coleslaw turkey um, clementines and Colt is also having a cheese stick and we're actually gonna eat in the living room in the living room tonight for just uh, kind of something fun and different. They said they not Santa's beard. No! No! I'm not that music. I'm not my beard. Mm -hmm. I'm not that music. 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 on the naughty list. That's that too. You got I know.
Say I love you. Mario. Yes, Mario. Mario. Well, hey guys, I think I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here for tonight. It's about 20 to 8, and the kids are finally in bed. Um, it just always seems to take forever anymore. We had a bit of an incident with Aubrey. She. Was a little too tired for her own good and took some good natured imagination play a little too far and some feelings were hurt and <sighs> it wasn't good. So we got that all taken care of. Um, feeling soothed and I think we're back to feeling well. Um, I have cleaned my kitchen today probably four times. <laughs> And I'm so done with it, um, and I still have a bit more to go here tonight. Um, I want to get the dishes put away, and I need to get my soup stock ready. I'm going to make it in my crock pot um, rather than doing it over the stove, so I can kind of leave it on all night. And I need to go take care of the dogs for the evening, feed them. Um, our one dog, B, she had diarrhea for the past two days in my house. Thankfully just in the laundry room, um, but it's awful and so she hasn't been well. So we're just um, slowly getting her back to uh, her regular food schedule, but until then we're going to um, mix in some rice with her food because that helps, I don't know, I guess it helps dogs when they are having stomach issues. So I gotta make rice now. <laughs> my kitchen cleaned and now I have to dirty more dishes because I didn't think to do it earlier. So I think that will um, kind of be it for my night. I am going to watch the Santa Claus tonight. I'm going to have two little truffles and I am going to um, really sit down and work with my Christmas menu. Um, a while ago I kind of listed everything out that we had thought about having. Today I'm going to make sure that I have all the recipes and I'm going to write all of the ingredients down that I'm going to need. I've been buying bits of things here and there so it won't just be such one big bill, um, but now is the time. It's time to get down to the wire so that's what I'm going to do. And I'm going to call my husband. He's still on the road. Um, so <laughs> long day but it was a good day and it was fun and thank you guys for spending it with me and I will see you in the next vlog bye okay so one last thing um, I need some help with a fudge recipe um, between the two different kinds the one is the kind where you just add like chocolate chips and sweetened condensed milk or the other kind is with marshmallow cream and a few other ingredients let me know which one is better um, there's a particular type of fudge that I'm thinking of that I have no idea how you make. It's kind of um, super fudgy and um, really creamy and super duper good. Of course, that's probably all fudges. But I don't know which one to make. Um, and you need your help. If you have done either one of those, if you prefer one to the other, will you let me know? Because I need some help and I don't want to waste ingredients if it's not going to be amazing. So let me know. I just wanted to show you my garland at night. This is something I didn't put in my home decor uh, video for Christmas. Initially this garland was actually on my dresser and half of the string of lights went out. So I was so frustrated. So tonight I took it off and I had kind of this idea. I have this berry garland and the berry garland had a string of lights woven in it. And I thought I'll just layer the two and just kind of make everything work and so that's what I did and I really love how it came out um, I have 
hanging here a few different um, little snowflakes. They're all the same, but they're hanging throughout uh, the garland. But I was just about ready to head to bed and turn off all of the lights. I thought it looked so pretty, so I thought I would just show you. <laughs> 